Hey guys, what's going on? It's Knock. Welcome along to a brand new video. Today we're going to play Turrets Protect the what? Turrets Protect the Exit Button by Robo SK. If you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. But without further ado, let's jump into the description. This map is built in BMOD 2.2.4 pre-release 26. Map is not difficult. On-off system created in Hammer by Toolby. Uh, description of uh, individual items and the features can be found there. Tutorial there. We don't need that. Tested by MIT 3368. And there was an update on the 17th and 19th of November. Alrighty then. Let's. Um, and I am. A, I've been quite a fan of these maps in the past. So, through here, I'm guessing we're going to get a button. Oh, sorry, a button cube. Do I want to go down there? I think I might not want to go down there until... No, it's just a return path. It's cool. Okay. Interesting that that's got a return path. I don't really... Anywho. Also respawn the cube. Interesting. So let's go and put the cube on the button. This will give us a permanent portal gun for the time being. And I believe looks like we may have some flinging to do. On the assumption I can see the ceiling. I don't need to see the ceiling, actually. Sp specifically. Okay, so, button. Gives me that towards the exit. Okay. I think I've also created the... Oh, no. I thought I was form flying then for a minute. Okay, so I think I can see what I need to do. I can see what this is all for now. It makes sense. It doesn't though, does it? Because that re that button also responds to cube. Okay. Let's readdress this then, shall we? Permanent portal gun. Can I? Oh, no, that's right. The absolute fizzlers. That's right. The absolute fizzlers fizzle the cube if it is sat on the yellow button. That's right. That's right. Now I remember. So, yeah, we do do this first then. But no, it's it's fizzling the cube. Why why is it fizzling the cube? I don't understand. No comprende. Why does that fizzle the cube? Oh, 
Okay, well. In that case. Let's do this instead. That works a lot better. Save. And down we go. Maybe there's a trigger there to do something with the cube. I, I'm not sure. Right, so there is our exit above us. I guess it's going to open up a panel. So, you can fling up to the top there. Gotcha. Okay, a bit of a troll button. Looks like that's permanent, though. get started here. Okay. That could be a good start. Then we're going to fling ourselves up to the top because we'll be able to... Okay, I need to move that pole. Uh, I need to put it there, don't I? And there. gets us up to the next area. Okay. So we can't bring a cube through here, because it will get dissolved. If it sits... Ah, uh, sorry, we, we can bring a cube through here, but we can't... If we walk over here when a cube is on that button, it will get dissolved. Okay. And like a donut. I just completely pressed the wrong port button. Okay. So let's go back up to the second area. So I'm pretty sure, I'll save just in case, I'm pretty sure I can take the cube over here. But I can't now walk back across to that area. But I will be able to fling over to here now. I don't know if I need to take that with me or not, so I'll leave that there for now. I'll be able to bring up to this top area here. Excellent. Okay. It's worth another save. Okay, just give me an app there, so I guess I rush round and shoot a portal on there. Is my hunch. Oh, 
Oh, but then I should have put the lift cube here. Because then I can pull that back and run back with a portal intact. Okay. Okay, Th things are, are coming together slowly. Leave this but this cube here, but just take it off the button. Then I can go over here. I can fling up to the other side. Okay. So now from here. This gets me a permanent portal gun, but also gets me out of this area and avoids the problem we had across there. Oh, interesting. So, okay, so we can't use that anymore. Something changed up here. Just go quickly. Yeah, okay. So there's a faith plate there that was, I'm guessing, was disabled previously. Okay. So. That's a way back. I'm wondering if I need the portal gun on the yellow, the button on the yellow portal again. Aha, I do. Okay. So we need to position the cube first on a floor portal surface. So where might I find a portal surface on the floor? That's right, isn't it? I need a portal surface on the floor. Or am I going crazy? I could place it there. Well, actually, the problem is now I can't because... Okay. Ooh. Oh, I don't need... Yeah, no, that's... Oh, what a dummy. I thought I positioned that first, but no, I don't need to position that first at all. I can put the portal. Then I can s just have a normal kind of... Yeah, that's it. There we go, overthinking. Oh, that gives me a permanent. So then I can now go up here from here. That's a really, actually, that's a really good use of um, a really good use of turrets, Robo. I'm quite, I'm quite happy with that. Uh, not happy with it, but I quite like the way you use the turrets. A lot of people use turrets in Portal 2 community maps as um, just an annoyance to the player. Um, rather than actually using them as a puzzle aspect to kind of like work around. But um, yeah, no, I'm going to add that one to my favorites. I enjoyed that. Good stuff, Robo. Good stuff indeed. Guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any matches to play, please leave them in the comments or head over to my Google form. I'll link to that in the description. But until next time, I've been Ock. You've been awesome. See ya.